Altair Flightstream is an aerodynamic CFD tool that utilizes panel and computational techniques to solve solutions for a wide range of aerodynamic applications. Let's take a look at setting up a problem in Flightstream for a rotating propeller. Our first step after importing the geometry is to build the mesh of our propeller. Meshing can be set up to trim a mesh across a surface or to align the mesh across multiple surfaces. In our case, we will utilize an aligned mesher and sweep the mesh so it's aligned on the bottom and top surfaces of the propeller. We will set a growth rate for a good mesh as well as setting periodicity to give us accurate results. After keying in our mesh settings, we can exit the dialog, then right click and generate our mesh. We can see with our mesh that there is one side of the propeller which has an open hole. Flightstream's fill hole feature allows us to fill this hole and to resolve this geometry. With our geometry filled, we also need to rotate our propeller, so it's in alignment of how it will rotate when we solve this model. Users can transform models translationally and rotationally in Flightstream. Now that our model is rotated, we can set the physics of our problem. We will set an unsteady flow problem and key in an angular velocity that corresponds with full rotation of the propeller. Velocities and accelerations can be controlled by location and time, and motion can even be specified as rotor or propeller specific. We key in our velocity and set the motion to be for a propeller. One of the big drivers in post-processing our results will be controlling the time increment and time iterations. In our case, we will key in an increment and time step that shows the dynamic response of our propeller while also allowing our solution to solve reasonably quick. With our time settings and motion properties set, we can now initialize the solver. Flightstream enables numerous mock settings as well as the ability to run with symmetry settings. In our model, we will run a subsonic flow, but we will utilize symmetry to simulate the full propeller. With these settings set, we can begin solving our model. Flightstream will show live solving and we can see our propeller rotating as it solves each iteration. We can see the wake lines it generates and ensure that the results are making sense during solving. With the model now successfully run, we can look at various plots to see if our propeller meets our design objective. We can look at plots like velocity, vorticity, and pressure to visually see what's happening to our model. Additionally, we can look at numeric plots to see results like thrust, torque, and other pertinent plots over the entire length of the simulation. With the ease of use and solving accuracy of Flightstream, engineers can improve their aerodynamic designs and solve even more efficiently. To learn more about Flightstream or other Altair products, go to www.trueinsight.io.